guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Miss Lauren Lee 11. If you're already a follower, subscriber of mine, thank you guys. Hey, how you doing? If you're new, thank you for stopping by and having a look and seeing what this channel is about. I'm gonna jump into it now. And as you can see from the title, this is my cheapest wash and go ever. So this wash and go is under five pounds, okay? Before I start, let me just say, the reason why I am looking for a cheaper alternative, as I think I've explained before, Basically, when I find a staple, it's going to be something I'm using for long term, let's say. Now, I don't want to be buying a product alone, which is just a shampoo for like £9, because that's not the one. <laughs> so I don't want to be buying a shampoo for £9, a co-wash for £7, a leave-in conditioner for £6, and let's say a styler for like £12. That's a lot of money a month. So, I'm on the quest, while still growing my hair, to find products that are affordable to me. I mean, others are affordable, but as a monthly routine, no, no. So guys, as I said, I'm gonna show you the products that I've used. So as you can see, my hair is prepped already. I've washed and conditioned. I'm gonna show you those two products that I've used to wash and condition my hair. And then the final product, which is a styling product. It's kind of like a leave-in cream, but it can be used by itself. Um, I wouldn't put a leave-in underneath this product, which I will show you in a second because it is quite dense and I don't want it weighing my hair down. I just want my curls to find and I want them to be, you know, light and voluminous and yeah. All right guys, so let me just start first with the shampoo, which is this. I've had this for a while now. This is when I last went to the States and I bought this in Dollar Tree and it is deep moisture shampoo from Shea Solutions and it says it's paraben free. I do like this shampoo, it makes your hair feel squeaky clean, but sometimes I find it's a bit too squeaky clean, so you do need to put that moisture back in your hair. But for a dollar, you can't go wrong. So a dollar is what, 60 pence, 60 odd pence or so, 60, 70 pence in the UK. Okay, so that's one dollar for the shampoo. Now the conditioner I found in our Poundland, which is equivalent to the dollar store, in the UK, they are starting to jump on this bandwagon of natural hair products, which I love. And this is one of the conditioners that I found in there, which is this. This isn't necessarily for natural hair. It is vegan friendly, which is excellent, and it works well for my hair, so I decided to use this conditioner today. And then finally, for the styler, which I'm about to show you, is... Cream of Nature, now you know I love my Cream of Nature line, the Argan Oil line from Morocco. This is my favorite, favorite, above all, Cream of Nature line. And it's the Creamy Oil Mo Moisturizing Hair Lotion, and it's a daily moisturizer, but I'm gonna use it as a styler. And it was 2 dollars guys, okay? £2.99. All right, so I'm just gonna stop chatting now, and I'm gonna go ahead and style my hair. So just carry on watching.
All right, guys, you've seen me do this so many times, so I'm just gonna complete it off camera, come back to you once it's fully uh, coated and saturated and applied, and then I will show you the dried results later on. Okay, okay guys, so there you have it. My hair is complete. I like to flip my hair to this side so it dries kind of in that position and it falls more back rather than in front of my face. As you can see, I've still got product residue on my hair and as it dries, that will disappear, that will fade. My hair is pretty wet. But anyway guys, this is my hair applied, I've gelled down my edges. Okay guys, so stay tuned.